Action. I don't think this rookie of the year award is going to add too much pressure. Um, I think it's kind of similar to the, when I was drafted. They have a lot of good young players and you know some good some good guys, and I think there's going to be a lot of a lot of fight in camp. I'm going there to you know to to get my spot to show you know to show Peter that I want to I want to you know, be a, a starter on the team. There's a lot going to be a lot of good midfielders, a lot of good players vying for a couple of positions, you know. But I'm looking forward to uh, the challenge. Realistic. You said you set the goal earlier this season of actually winning this award. How realistic did you think it was at the time? I thought it was very realistic. I think that um, I think all the rookies had the same goal, you know, um, and they all probably felt the same way that I felt that it was a realistic goal for them. But um, yeah, I thought it was a realistic goal, and so I just worked towards it, and it paid off, and here yeah, it is. I don't think this rookie of the year award is gonna add too much pressure. Um, I think it's kind of similar to the when I was drafted. You know, I got drafted number one, but Going into camp, but it doesn't mean anything anymore. You know, I'm just another player trying to compete for a spot and make a team. So that's the mindset I have right now, and that's the mindset I'm going to stick to, and just going to go out there and try to just work as hard as I can and try to perform and try to impress. I think training camp is going to be competitive. I mean, this age group is real deep. I think there's a lot of talented guys in this age group, and so that's going to make for competitive practices, trainings, games. The whole nine yards is going to be it's going to be great. We have a lot of good young players, and you know, some good some good guys and I think there's going to be a lot of a lot of fight in camp. You know, I don't know if I'll be playing in the middle or maybe out wide in, in, in the midfield, but uh, you know, Mo Adu has really shown that he had a great rookie year and, and you know, a good time with, the, with these two games he played for the national team too. So, you know, he's a guy that whether I'm battling a position for him or we're going to be playing together in the midfield, it's something good. You know, there's also talented guys like Stuart Holden and, and Arturo Alvarez. Alvarez. All set up by that great pass by Ricchetti. In a good way, I think it's going to be a challenge for the coach. Uh, you know, I think um, the, the player pool for, for this Olympic team, is, it's, uh, it's pretty big. It's, you know, it's really good. It's deep. And, you know, the, but I think that's something that the coaches are looking forward to work with. I know Peter, Peter Novak and from the first camp we had uh, early, earlier this year. And, um, you know, I've, uh, I've never actually been, uh, been involved with Peter too much in, in previous uh, coaching or, or uh, soccer events. But, you know, from what I've heard, he's, he's a great coach. And, um, you know, he, uh, he likes to go, put, go to work. So, you know, I'm, I'm looking forward to a, to a good camp and uh, a lot of hard work and, uh, and good preparation for the Olympics. Peter's a good guy. He obviously knows the game very, you know, very well. You know, he played at the, in the top flight in Europe and, and you know, he, he did well in MLS in his days too. So. He's hard and he challenges you every day, which is good, which is what you want from a coach. You know, he's really intense. He, uh, you know, he wants everyone working, you know, hard and giving it 110% and, and uh, you know, helping each other out. And he's a member that, that he uh, likes to talk to your players. He's a, you know, he has a good communication with the players. So uh, it should be, a, should be a pretty good all around uh, camp. And action. There's numerous others that can play the same position as me just as well, if not better. So, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's going to be a real competitive environment. I'm looking forward to it, looking to see where I stand against other players, and, and hopefully at the end of the day I'll be on that team. I'm going there to, you know, to, to get my spot, to show, you know, to show Peter that I want to I wanna, you know, be a, a starter on the team. There's going to be a lot of people uh, in, you know, vying for midfield positions, and people that have already been involved with the national team before, you know, so there's, there's a good group of players, there's going to be a lot of good midfielders, a lot of good players vying for a couple of positions, you know, but I'm looking forward to uh, the challenge.